this is Monkey 1000. We are at River Junction Campground. Now this is the picnic area for the daytime. You can come down here and put your boat and um, have a picnic. It's very pretty so I'm going to show you. My hand might be jerking a little bit because I have Bruno in my hand. So we're going to walk around here a little bit and see what we can see. We went to another uh, campground. It's called Hog Hog Camp Campground and um, oh I'm going to sneeze. I'm sorry. Um, so we went to Hog Hog, hog Campground and it was very <coughs> excuse me it was very very pretty um, and nice campground sites we're looking for campground sites that aren't too far from the house that we can come out on the weekend uh, they don't allow pets so we probably won't be going there um, that's a shame too because it's really nice sites they have a picnic table and they have a fire pit for you there and they have water so that's you know nice to have um, it's a shame they don't allow pets. So we can't leave Bruno at home, you know, so we always take him everywhere we go. So we'll we'll see if this one, this one's right next door to it pretty much. Um, so we'll see if this one um, will allow Bruno. And if it does, we're going to try to come here next um, when it warms up a little bit more. And we'll come in, out here before it gets too, too hot. But I'm going to show you right now. This is the Wislacoochee River that you see behind me. So we're going to kind of just show you um, down the river here a little bit. And we'll show you some stuff. Alright, so I'm going to turn you around. And this is the Wislacoochee River. It goes a long ways. You can take this river all the way into Georgia. And it goes even further than Georgia, I believe. It's very pretty. People are fishing out here today. And there were some people here, they just left. It's very, very pretty. And we're going down here. And wow, isn't that awesome? Look at that bird. Look at that bird. Wow. So cool. I'm going to walk down here. We saw, I do not know what these are. This is, I guess, where the boat ramp is. And I, I have no clue what that is. Um, if that was part of a bridge at one time. Um, because that's what I thought it was coming to see was a bridge and then we ended up right where we wanted to be. So it kind of was a little confusing. But that is so pretty. Really, really pretty. It's a nice day today. It is warming up here. It's been very cold, so we've been really, really cold. So let me go down here a little bit and show you some more down this way. And there's Bruno, exploring. He's my explorer. So, is that a bridge, you think? We'll have to look it up and see if we can find anything. Yeah, we'll, we'll Google it and we'll put it up in our, in our video so then you can see. I bet you that was an old bridge at one time. You know, because a lot of um, uh, cargo ships went through here, boats and stuff, they used to go through here a lot. So maybe that had something to do with it. We'll look it up. Interesting. Very interesting. There is a sign on it. Did you focus up onto the sign? Oh, is it? Uh. Wow, it's really pretty through here. I'd love to have the boat through here. Really, really pretty with the GNU. Let me see if I can zoom in. I don't know if I can zoom in all the way. Probably. Wow, look at that. My hand's unsteady. Sorry. Try to get it where I can see it better. Oh look, yeah, look at that, there we go. Oh. 
Bruno tugged on me. It's kind of hard for me to keep my hands steady with him in my arms. So, yeah, we'll just zoom it back out. <laughs> so, but it is very, very pretty through here. Gorgeous. Really pretty. They got trails through here. They got horse trails and you know, you can take your your canoe and your kayak through here. Very, very pretty. Oh, isn't that interesting, that thing right there? I, I wonder if it's just a, a guide or... I bet you there was a bridge or something here at one time. Yeah, probably. Let's go down here and see if there's any remnants on this side showing that there was some kind of bridge or something here. Ooh, look at that tree. Isn't that cool? Very strange. <laughs> Different. The water probably comes up that far and it's probably made its thing. Very cool. Yeah. Huh. I was trying to see, so you can see it over there now a little bit better. See if I can zoom it in. There you go. I come down here a little bit and see what there is. It's pretty for here. Really pretty. Very nice. Yeah, I bet you the water came up all the way up here at one time. Huh. Come on. I know. No. Where are we going? Cool. Very cool. So, Luna's doing his little sniffy time. <laughs> so I'm letting him kind of stroll through here. We won't go too far. Go on the other side over here. See, see what we can see. And then we'll, we'll walk back. This would be, probably be a very cool place to, to come and just hang out for the weekend and walk around the trails. But when you do it, you don't want to do it in the summer. It's just too hot here. But about this time, this is good weather right now. And getting even a little... Um, you know, Jay Bear, I think he went back to the truck, so. <laughs> so I'm kind of by myself, so I don't want to go too far. I'm going to have to wait. Yeah. But this is pretty neat. Yeah. And the trail goes on and on and on, so. That will be pretty cool. So this will be something we'll have to do more exploring with when in the future. So we're going to go back to the truck and we'll see what else we can find. Um, I want to see the camping thing. So um, for this side it's supposed to be, be pretty too to see. So we'll try to get that in here. And we will be back. Stay tuned. Hey everyone. I found this pretty little church. Isn't that pretty? It is really cute. And our little thing. We found a cemetery over where the water was. So we were kind of trying to find it. And I saw this one so... I stopped at it, but it's not the one that we saw from the woods. 
So I'm going to try to find it if I can, and we'll be back. This is pretty cool. It's pretty in here. Big cemetery in here. Very, very pretty. They got a little thing here, a plaque over here. It's called Indian Hill Cemetery. So, it's a pretty little church though, I thought. Cute. Let me go in here for a minute and look around. Shea Bear's not getting out. He's getting a little tired. Can't walk much. So, let's see what this plaque says here. There's a plaque here. It's called Indian Hill Cemetery. James Knight, September the 11th, 1891. Ah, let's see if you can see it better. Yeah, that's cool. There. Huh. So, I admit, this is an old cemetery. Around 1891. Look at them all, they're all lined up, whole family. Wow. This is 1927 here. Uh, they got their names and everything on here. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. Vision to Dennis. Uh, maybe their brother and sister? I don't know. Maybe mother and son? Uh, yeah, he died in 2000. And then there's Crawford. Is this Crawford? Uh, wow. He died in 1980. He was born in 1907. And that must be his wife. And she died in 1979. And she was born in 1900. Wow, 1900. And then this one. Frank Monroe. Anderson. He was in World War One. Wow. Before 1895, and he died in 1933. Uh, it says father on here, and that was the mother, and that was the father. So those two were married. The other one's beside me, and he was a father, and he died. Wow. So this is a very old cemetery. Uh, wow. Cool. Let me see what's over here. Oh wow. That's a very old one. If you can read it. Wow, isn't that something? Yeah, dang. And it goes on. Old tombstones here. These are probably people that they can't, don't know. Yeah, very old. Wow. and she died in 1915. Cool. Very cool. Hmm. Let's go check that one out over there. And then we'll mosey on and on. This shea bear wants to... So. It is very, very pretty. It's pretty in here. Yeah. I fascinate you. It's just amazing how old some of these are. These were 1921s. That's a baby there. These are babies. Aw. Two babies. This was 1916. Aw. Wow. Yeah. That was a baby too. Makes you wonder, don't it? But I guess they had a lot of diseases back then, you know. So, 
And they didn't have what we have. Wow, look at this. This is something here. Wow. Yeah, this must be a family here. Family or something right in here. Ooh, kind of gives you a spooky feeling. This is cute. In tears could build a stairway and memories a lane. I'd walk right up to heaven and bring you home again. Isn't that pretty? Really, really pretty. Aww. Well, so that goes back against that fence way back there. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, he's got poinsettias out here. Somebody's been putting poinsettias out here. And these are 1970, 1955. So, hmm. Wow. Yeah. So, this is an old one. Well, this is 1972. Yeah. We miss you. Mama, ah, and this is a baby. It's a baby Hayes. It was 1979. Ah, November the 30th, 1979. Ah, that's a shame. Yeah, hard to babies. These are a little bit more up to date. 1999. Hmm. Bonnie Lynn Barber. Sissy, we love you. Aw, that's cool. Very pretty. Isn't that pretty? Her favorite was her cat and her dog. Very cool. Her little doll fell down. Uh, hmm. It was so windy yesterday, that's probably why. Yep. There's nothing on this one, it's just gravel. I wonder why married husband and wife here. Huh. Well. Well. So anyways, this is a glimpse of Indian Hill Cemetery. I'm going to try to find the other one. Oh, that's really pretty tombstone. It's got a boat on it. Isn't that pretty? Wow. Well, you must have liked to go boating. Yeah, that's really, really pretty. Let me see if I can. Yeah, there you go. That's a lot better. Cool. And this has got horses on it. This is husband and wife here. Yeah. She just has 1961 on this one, so that's probably when she died, I would assume. And he died in 83. Uh, she died before him. Yep. Well. This is a pretty cemetery. I really like it here. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I wonder why they just have them in the ground. That's all they do is put a little thing on them. Aw, yeah. oh, this is a Kylie Chase doll. Oh, baby. Lord, hold my hand. Aw. Wow. Cute little thing. 
He died in 1994 and he was born oh, close to my birthday. He was born in 92. Short, short life. Poor little thing. Huh. Okay, so anyways, we're going to go and let me see if I can find the other one. I believe it's a military um, cemetery, so we're going to go and look at it. He's still sitting there. <laughs> I think he's getting tired. He got out and moved around a bit. He hasn't been feeling so good, so it was good to get him a little fresh air, though. I'm trying to to do that so he gets a little bit of fresh air. We got some really pretty tombstones, you know? They're so some of them are really, really pretty. They're nice to look at. They fascinate me. <laughs> I don't know why, but they do. Interesting. It's sad to see these babies in here though. But you know it happens unfortunately. So anyways, just stay tuned. Oh, there's the Williams family. <laughs> I wonder if they're any relation. <laughs> I don't know. Don't think so. Nope. I doubt it. Huh. Wow. You never know. Huh. Yeah, there's another one. Thought he was in the army here. Peter Stephen Williams, U.S. Army. Vietnam. He was in Vietnam. Wow. So anyways, we're going to go and stay tuned. We'll find some more adventures. Here I, here I found another one here. It was a baby. Baby Trey. It's cute. And they got the angel looking at him. Isn't that pretty? Really, really cool. He was born in 1997. He died in 2001. That's too bad. There's a say here, but I'm not going to read it. So if you want to freeze it, you can. If you can see it. I don't know. The sun's kind of on it. So if you want to freeze it, you can read it. Okay. Stay tuned. Okay guys, we're at another cemetery that wasn't far from the one that I just left. Um, this is called Wild Cow Prairie Cemetery. It was in the early 1800s. And these are all um, veterans. So let's go and see what we can find in here. Jay Bear's already ahead of me. I have Bruno with me. So we're going to go in this little cemetery. We're near the highway here. So. This is probably was here way before the highway was, I would say. <laughs> I don't think they had them back then. So, very, very cool. Let's see here. Wow, this is really cool. Yeah. Wow, 1857 died in 1909. Wow, came on to me and I will give you rest. Very interesting. These old tombstones are amazing. How long they last and what they've been through and you know, and people are living and building up and around them. It's got a little baby thing on there. Huh. I wonder if that's a little no, it wouldn't be. I wouldn't think so, no. But maybe that was from his baby. And there's another one too. I wonder why they have those there. That's kind of weird. I don't know what they mean. Maybe Shea Bear does. Maybe there has some kind of meaning to them. Well, I can't read it. 1831 he was born and I think that's 18 something in December. Wow. Cool. Very, very cool. Let's check these ones out over here. Indiana Indian Wars. Wow, his 
Isn't that something? That is so cool. Wow. Ha. Very, very cool. This is another one, Indian War. I wonder if I can focus a little bit better so you can see a little bit better. There you go. Yeah. Wow. Ha. That is something. This is something. Well, this one is. Look at this one. See how old it is. Wow, this is so old. Huh. They don't have anything on them. Uh, they were probably out in the woods, you know. Now we've got highways here. But it looks like it's well maintained. Somebody takes care of this. Yeah. So that one was, he died. It says January 18th, 1880. He was aged 57 years. Have broken, they must have bought a new one for him. Put a new one up. Yeah, I would think that's what they did. Oh, it probably fell off. That's what it did. It broke. Yeah, that's what it did. It broke off and it, and it cracked. And someone just placed it down on the front. Yeah, that's what happened. Wow, 1848. Let's see what this one is. Thomas M. Mobley. What's CSA mean? What's CSA mean? I don't know. I'm I don't know. Sure. No? Nope. So, wow. And Thomas did you see M. Mobley. Did you see those ones with the Indian War? Yeah. Forty second ALA infantry. Yeah. Hi, huh, interesting. Yeah, I'm not sure what the C O D or the C S A stands for. Mm mm. Maybe somebody knows and can tell us. Yeah, if you guys yeah. know. Tell us below. Yeah. Maybe tell us below. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna go over here and we'll check yeah. these ones out. Alabama infantry. I have I don't know. And here's one here. Look at how tiny this little thing is. Isn't that something? Is he, was, he was he buried over here? Your sister's last name? No. James, my sister's fiance. Yeah, does he have family member over this way? You'd have to ask him. Yeah, that's right. He is. Yeah, it could be. But I don't know if that's Because don't they come over this way to visit family of his? I think, think they have. But this one's falling over. Yeah. But they don't have anything on these ones. They're falling over. This one's very pretty. That's really, really pretty. Cool. Very cool. And it has a sign here. Let me see if I can get it. This is the angel praying. We're praying. That's very, very pretty. See that? Yeah. Looks like she may be crying, an angel crying. Yeah. So. Let's see if 
I can get it over here a little bit. All right, I'll take you back. Then. Crying or praying, yeah. Wow. That's cool. Very cool. That's a crying. Yeah. Like crying. Yeah. That's cool. Very interesting. And they take care of it. Yeah. Yeah, it's well taken care of. There's nothing back there, I don't think. No. Yeah. Alrighty. Well, if we find something else interesting, we'll, we'll film it. So stay tuned. There's the flag up there. That's cool. Got a little breeze going on today. The uh, Boy Scouts are taking care of this. Are they? Yeah. It's an eagle project. Oh, well that's cool. That's cool. The Boy Scouts are taking care of it, Shea Bear says. So that's really, really nice. That's cool. It's good for them to do that. Keep it nice. Important. And there we go. Shea Bear's filming. So we will see if we can find something else and we'll get right back to you if we do. Okay? Stay tuned. There's Bruno doing a shaking. <laughs> okay guys, we're at another camping area. We were here a long time ago um, and we could never get in and we still can't get in. So we park here, I guess. That's what we do. Look at all these locks. I got different kinds of locks and all kinds of craziness going on in here. So it doesn't say it's a private area. It's a flea eagle preserve. And so um, we're going to go down a ways because by this map, I'm showing you the map here. Let me focus a little bit. Here's the map. And we are right here where the star is. So we're gonna go over here because this is where there's tenting and stuff. And 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 the, and it says we're allowed to be here during the daytime. It does have that here. And so we're gonna check it out and see what we can find. And find out if we can camp here or, or what. There's somebody camping here from Perth, Ontario, Canada. Really? Yeah. Wow. So there's people able to camp in here then. So it's we're going to go down here and check Today's it out. The first, right? Yeah. These are all today. Oh wow. Cool. That is very cool. So and we're going to go right in here. This is for your horses here if you can see. And this is over here is going to be where the tents are being able to tent and stuff there. And this is all trails and stuff that you can go on. And walk around you can horseback ride and um, that so we've liked this this is right here where we live so um you know it's not far from the house we could come on a Friday night put a tent up you know and um, after I get off work or whatever and come and spend a couple of days here if you want and do some of these trails and just hang out and enjoy weather and and just enjoy each other you know, sometimes you don't have to go hot far from your house to enjoy the area. And here in Florida, there's a lot to see and do around our area. So, we're going to go walking. Shea Bear signed the book here. And we're going to go walking down that rail. So, when we get down closer, I'll turn you back on and we'll show you what we can see. That's an airboat that you hear. They're on the on the river there, or the lake. What's over here? Is that still the Wissacoochee River? I don't know if it's the river or the lake. I don't know either, but we'll probably get down that far and be able to see. So there are people here staying. So that's very interesting. So, I'll be back. So guys, we're walking down this road here trying to find out where all the camping stuff is. We did pass the horse 
area. So it should be up here, not too far. Probably around that bend up there. And this is what we see. This is bear country here, so we'll be out for the bears. I hope this leads right into the down to the water. That would be really pretty. Camp out here, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Well, not far with all the airboats. Yeah. I don't no. Know if that's the river or if that's the lake. Because there's so many lakes around here. Yeah. You so never know. Yeah. Well, we'll get to at the bottom of this one. All right. We'll be back. Okay, so. Enjoy your public land, it says. Look at that thing right there. Water pump. Old water pump there. That's pretty cool. Very, very cool. What's this say? Non-portable water. Do not drink. So it actually works. That's really cool. And... Oh, wow. Yep. So, it says, enjoy your public land. So, personal automobiles, campsites are available to individual campers through a free reservation available at watermatters.org. So, we can have him in the campgrounds. Well, that's cool. You guys can freeze this if you'd like to read it and you're interested and you never know. So we're gonna go down here and we're not far from the water because we just saw that airboat go through there. And when we get down there, I'll turn you back on. Okay, so now we have come to some. There's the water there. Very cool. Uh, we saw a sign that said no vehicles beyond the, the camping thing. That means don't go making yeah, right. And that's probably because of this bridge right here. This is, this is how the airboats get across. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah, that's how the airboats get across here. I'll show you a little closer as we get there. Yeah, I wish we'd have been here just a minute sooner. They would have seen that. Yeah, you would have saw that airboat. Yeah, they go across here. And they jump, and see, he did. He went across over to the other side. That's very cool, huh? Yeah. Yeah, how they do that. And they go their merry way. Very, very cool. Oh, wow, this is so pretty in here. Isn't this awesome? Really pretty. Really, really pretty. Ah, oh, so, so peaceful. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was a fish that just jumped. There's some fishing. Fish is jumping. There's some fishies. Very, very pretty. Wow. And then you got this way. Yeah. And there's your little sign there. Okay. Wow. Huh. Cool, huh? Yep. Yep. So we're gonna go down here a little ways and see if we can find the camping part. Okay. Okay? You okay? Yeah. Okay. And we'll come back this way. We'll be back. Yeah. I don't think I got him. A little armadillo. Yeah. Okay, guys, I think we're going to get to see an airboat cross here. He sounds very close, so let's watch and see. Yeah, he's 
coming. There he is. He's coming around the bend. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's going to go over the bridge, so we'll we'll get this for you. Won't get wet. It's got to slow down. Yeah, this is cool. So he's going to go right up over here, yep. right across the road. He's got a doggy too. <laughs> a dog out enjoying the boat ride. Mm, it's beautiful, yeah. He's Having him a cold drink. This is cool. He saw that dog, didn't he? Yeah, he did. You see how that dog sat down and just hovered down? Yeah, he yeah. knew. He's yeah. been a, he's been a, through here a couple times. Yeah. Okay, guys, there you go. Okay. We wanted to get that for you. So. Sorry about the noise, but that's awesome. Yeah. I love it. That was cool. Yeah. Really cool. Yeah, there's little fishies jumping. I think you got them, didn't you? The fishies. No. Jumping. No, oh, they're just little yeah, they shiners. Just, they get disturbed from the oh, shad, motion. yeah. So that was pretty neat. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> just to watch that. And he was fun waving and stuff. Yeah, having him cold drink. Yeah. That's the life right there, man. Yep. Yeah. Really, he could have picked us up and we could have went with him. Yeah. <laughs> He stopped there. I thought he was going to say, you want a beer? <laughs> yeah, I'll have a beer with you. Let's go. <laughs> All right, we'll be back with you. That's funny. This is cool. It's not for drinking. Cool, huh? Come in and pick one out. Okay guys, we have found the other part here where the horses and stuff. Look at he's looking. I wonder how far he can go. Mm -hmm. Huh? He's fine. Why would they leave their dog out here and they're gone? Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe they are. Ah. Nice puppy. So He's watching. Oh, he can't go too far. Oh, okay. We're good. <laughs> I was scared there for a minute. Anyways, we're going down here. This is where they have the horses and stuff, but you can camp over here. So we're going to look over here and see if you like it here or over on the other side. And then we're going to try to come here maybe in a few weeks and uh, on a weekend. And, you know, it's nice because it's not far from us. It's a nice little getaway and just nice. If we forget something, we're 10 minutes from the house. Yeah, yeah. We can always leave and come back. Yeah. So that's kind of nice. Yeah. So it looks like it goes way back in there. I don't know if there's all kinds of camping sites out there or not. We'd have to look at the map and see. Yeah, we're not going to go farther, any farther, because, you know, if we came in here, we'd get a, 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 a code. And then we get, um, you know, we can drive in here, so, and camp up 
Yeah, see, there's a big fire pit you can cook on. Yeah, this one's got a big old grill. Yeah. Yeah, the other one didn't have nothing. Because when I'm camping, I cook. I cook. So, and the toilet's right there. Yep. And, you know, the only problem, this is very open. I don't know where we would hear. Because you'll want some shade. Well, I know. I'm just, yeah. We'll have to look. That's later. Yep. So, anyways, this is pretty cool. I'm going to sit here for a minute. Ugh. Turn you around. There we am. So, there we are. So, anyways, I'm going to say I'm out for now. Um, hopefully, y'all have a good week and hope you enjoyed the video. And please put a thumbs up and hit the subscription button, please. And so we'll we'll. This is cool. I'm ready to come camping. Yeah. So. Off we go. Stay tuned for another video. And have a good week. Monkey's out for now. Bye, y'all.